Hi everybody, so what I am planning on doing today is if you've been watching the wrap up videos you know that I have made a list of series that I both plan on finishing before the end of the year and a different list of series that I plan to start before the end of the year. So in this video I'm just going to share what those series are and hopefully I'm going to be able to do all of them. I am figuring that I am on track to finish them all. As so the first series that I plan on finishing before the end of the year is the Percy Jackson series. And I have already read the first four in that series, so the, the only book I have left in that series is the last one, The Last Olympian. I'm really excited to get around to reading this one. It's, you know, four books have been leading up to this one. It's, the series is getting really intense, and there's just so much that's going to happen. But at the same time, it's the last book in a series that always makes me nervous. The next series I plan on finishing is the Vampire Academy series. So I have read the first five books in that series now because I have read, or I have read Spirit Bound as part of my to be read list for this month. So the only one I have left is Last Sacrifice, and this one is kind of a monster. It's huge, but I am planning on finishing it. I have still three months left, so I should be able to do it. And if you watched the wrap-up video from last month, you know I read Hollowed, so the Unearthly series by Cynthia Hand. I only have Boundless left, and after reading Hollowed, it kind of makes me nervous for this one. I didn't enjoy Hollowed as much as I enjoyed Unearthly, but I'm hoping that this is a really good wrap-up to the series. The Nightshade trilogy. So I've already read Nightshade. So the next two books that I have to read in that series is Wolfsbane and Blood Rose. Right, so the next series on the list that I made is the Nightshade Trilogy, and for that I still have to read Nightshade and Blood Rose. And this is one that I, I kept putting off this series because I've heard a lot of good things about it, but I've also heard a lot of bad things about it, especially the ending to the series, and that makes me really nervous because I... You know, I already get nervous about the ending to series, so hearing so much negativity about it, that's just not good for me. So I am definitely going to be finishing it, though, before December 31st. And then the last series on my list is the Divergent series. So I will be reading Allegiant. Allegiant is already on my to-be-read list for October, so... This series will be completed before the end of the month. So, and then the five series that I picked that I will be beginning before the end of the year. I want to read the Tiger Saga. So Tiger's Curse is the first one. There's four books in this series so far. There's a fifth one coming out. So this is one I really wanted to get on because I don't want them to keep piling up. The Uglies series. I keep hearing good things about it. I keep hearing kind of okay things about it as well. Perfect Chemistry, which I have already read, so that one has been checked off. The Maze Runner, which I am reading right now. I'm not that far into it, but so far it's pretty good. And then the last series on the list is Fallen. And this is another one. It's already completed, so I really have to get on reading this one. So I'm going to do that before the end of the year. I'm hoping that by making these lists, it's going to help cut down my to-be-read list by a lot, but that's only going to happen if I can kind of control my book spending. So that's probably not actually going to end up happening. But that's all for now, and I will see everybody next time.